secret. Sometimes it's better not to say anything. Stay tuned. All right. Sometimes it is better not to say anything. And I have people in my life that I would watch them not react. And I would watch them just soak in what was happening and have no reaction. And at the time I thought, oh, you must be numb. There must be no feeling or emotion within you. I'm a very passionate person and um, I just didn't understand it. But truth be known, I just wasn't mature enough. Um, I still let, I was still letting my emotions rule me. I was letting my emotions lead what I say. I was letting my emotions lead how I reacted. I would say probably in the last month, as you guys know, I, my whole life has changed in a month. In the last month, that also has changed. And I can sit and I cannot react and I can absorb the situation. Let it fly off my shoulder. Let it just be something I just brush away because it's not worth a reaction. Now, and it's very odd. <laughs> it's a very odd feeling, you know? I'm just sitting there and I'm like, wow, I have nothing to say to you. <laughs> I have nothing to say to react to this because it's not going to change anything. Your reaction usually just fuels the fire in the other person. Your reaction usually just fuels the fire within yourself. Maybe it's because I am learning that what, what we don't like in other people, what bothers us in other people, nine times out of ten, it's because we don't like it in ourselves. We don't want that for ourselves. And I guess because I'm shucking a lot of things, um, I don't absorb, I don't absorb garbage. I don't absorb just stupid reactions. I don't absorb nonsense. <laughs> and it's a new place for me. And it's a good place. Because I noticed myself this weekend a couple different times where I didn't have a reaction. Didn't respond. Just looked at the person. And they looked back at me and was waiting. Waiting. What is Sheila going to do? Is she going to fly off the handle? Is she going to cuss at me? Is she going to agree with me? Have I persuaded her enough to say, oh, you're right? Am I going to make her cry? Because that's at least a reaction. I got nothing. <laughs> nothing. And I walked away from it even stronger and realizing my emotions are not ruling me. For the first time in my life, people, I am 44 years old. Oh gosh, I am 44 years old and my emotions aren't ruling me finally. Maybe I am growing up. If you find yourself in a place where your emotions rule you, where your emotions cause a reaction um, in whatever situation you're in, don't chalk it up to that's just my personality. Start asking yourself why. Why? Why is this causing a reaction out of me? Is this person not giving me what I need? Am I asking too much? It, does this person even know what I need? Is this person just trying to get a reaction because it's fun? My husband does try to because he likes to see me get feisty. But <laughs> I have been sassy and feisty on my own for the last month. So I guess he's seeing enough of that that he tries not to trigger it. <laughs> anyway, I hope I gave you something to think about. And I hope that if you're in a spot where your emotions are ruling you, and you are reacting all over the place that you're challenged a little bit to question that and maybe you're not ready. I never realized how bad it was until 
now. And I'm like, whoa, whoa, wow. <laughs> and it's a great feeling because I'm in control of what's going on in, in here and in here. I'm in control of how I react to other people. No reaction is always better than a wrong reaction. But you have to get to the point of having no reaction. You have to get to the point of your emotions not ruling you. Maybe someone's having a bad day. They're jumping on you because you just happen to be there. I hope this video finds you all very well, and I'm so glad that you took the time to watch. If you have not subscribed, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button. Um, in the videos ahead, you will, you will have a grocery haul coming. I'm going to the grocery store today. That might be up tomorrow. Um, this video will be up later this afternoon, this evening, maybe a grocery haul tomorrow. And then of course my, that secret secretary life <laughs> will be maybe on Saturday. We'll see. Um, we've got football Thursday night and maybe football Friday night. I'm not sure. We'll see. Until I talk to you next time, thank you for being you because you bring something to this world that no one else can.